Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. We have been talking about Khidr alayhi salam. So some people ask, okay, when Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said that I wish Musa alayhi salam would have shown more patience. May Allah have his mercy on Musa alayhi salam. If he would have shown more patience, we could have learned more things from Khidr alayhi salam. The story of Musa alayhi salam and Khidr alayhi salam comes in great detail in Surah Al-Kahf, which I've already spoken to you about in great detail. And for those of you who are interested can read that story in Surah Al-Kahf. The narration that I'm talking about with Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, may Allah have mercy on Musa alayhi salam. I wish he would have stayed stronger in this and then we would have learned more. Uh, this is a narration that comes from Sahih al-Bukhari in Kitab al-Ilm and also is reported in different books of tafsir and also is reported by Imam Muslim in al-Sahih Kitab al-Fadail Fadail al-Khidr. Now here comes the question, did Khidr alayhi salam prepared some kind of tests for Musa alayhi salam? If so, how many were they? Well, when Musa alayhi salam met Khidr alayhi salam and they were about to depart from each other, Khidr alayhi salam said to Musa alayhi salam that if you would have shown patience, I could have shown you a thousand different things. And each and every one was different from the other. And it would have been something that you have never seen before. And upon hearing this, Musa alayhi salam cried when they were parting from each other that he wished if he would have stayed a bit longer and would have seen all those different examples that Khidr alayhi salam had prepared for him. At that point, both prophets advised each other and they parted their ways. And this is reported in Hayat al Hayawan al Kubra, volume 1, page 486. Also, in the same book, Hayat al Hayawan al Kubra, volume 1, page 486, and also in Tariq Rawdat al Safa, volume 1, page 92, there is a story of Sheikh Muhayuddin ibn Arabi. This is the same person um, who is also called Sheikh Akbar. And his name was Abu Bakr Muhyiuddin Muhammad bin Ali. And he was from Andalusia, uh, city Murcia. He wrote a lot of books. And one of the famous one is Fatihat Makiya. And uh, he passed away in Damascus. And he is uh, buried in Jahal Qasiyun. As, and his life history comes in many books like Lawaqih al-Anwar, volume 1, page 188. Anyway, Sheikh Muhyiuddin ibn Arabi who lived from 560 to 638 Hijra, which is approximately 900 to 800 years ago, uh, he says that he met Khidr alayhi salam. And then he asked him about his experience with Musa alayhi salam and the things that they discussed. So Khidr alayhi salam explained him things that happened between him and Musa alayhi salam. And then Muhyiuddin ibn Arabi says that when I asked him more about um, the tests, he said, well, I had prepared up to a thousand different things. However, Musa alayhi salam could only stay with me for three of them. And after that, we parted our ways. Anyway, uh, in the next lecture, we'll talk about whether Khidr alayhi salam was a wali, was a prophet or a messenger or an angel. That's another viewpoint. Some people say he was an angel. So we'll talk about all four of these viewpoints with you, but in the next video. Till then, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.